guys, I'm Kelly, from a trainer from More Than Mary, and uh, I want to show you the perfect form for a bent over row today. This is one that most of the people in my class have a lot of trouble with, so I want to make sure everybody has the perfect form down so you don't hurt your back um, and it's the most effective workout possible. So, to start with, I want you to give me a nice solid stance, and as you bend forward, notice my hips go back so that my spine can stay long. The biggest mistake I see with this is people rounding over. But once I've rounded my spine, my back muscles no longer contract effectively. So I'm going to bend my knees, hips go back, chest stays open, roll my shoulders back so they're set solidly in my pocket, and then I'm going to start my row from there. So my first movement is all about stabilizing my core, getting a nice flat back. The more parallel to the ground you can get, the harder the movement will be, the harder the core movement will be. But now I'm working my entire back. My low muscles, my low back muscles are working to stabilize me. My shoulder girdle's working. And how much weight are you using? I'm using 15. Back in the day when we did a lot of bench rows, I could use a lot more weight because I have a lot more stability. But I actually prefer to drop down my weight a little bit and have to utilize my whole core. So we talked about, you know, functional fitness. We do a lot of this every day. Reach over, grab something. So we need to be able to stabilize from here. So try those on your own. See how they work for you. See if you feel new, new muscles this time. And I uh, hope you get a good workout. And if you have any questions, you can email her. <laughs> yes, you can. Kelly at morethanmary.com. Thank you. Bye. Have a good workout.